One sunny afternoon, four best friends, Alex, Bella, Chris, and Dana, received a mysterious invitation. It was for an adventure in the old horror house at the edge of town. The friends stood in front of the horror house. It looked old and creepy, but their excitement overshadowed their fear. With a mixture of excitement and trepidation, they pushed the creaky door open and stepped inside. The house was dark, with only a few beams of light sneaking through the dusty windows. As they walked down the hallway, they noticed an old portrait on the wall. The eyes in the painting seemed to follow them, making the hairs on their necks stand up. They entered the living room, where the air was thick with dust. On a table in the center of the room was an ancient book with strange symbols. As they opened the book, words began to glow on the pages. It read, Solve the riddles to uncover the secrets of the horror house. The first riddle appeared, I have keys but open no locks. I have space but no room. You can enter, but you can't go outside. What am I? Bella thought hard and then exclaimed, It's a piano. The others agreed, and as they said the answer aloud, the piano keys started playing by themselves. The piano music triggered a hidden mechanism, revealing a door behind a bookshelf. The friends looked at each other with wide eyes before stepping through. They found themselves descending into a dark, creepy basement. The air was cold, and strange noises echoed around them. On an old mirror, another riddle appeared in the fog, I speak without a mouth and hear without ears. I have no body, but I come alive with the wind. What am I? After a moment of silence, Chris whispered, It's an echo. Suddenly, they heard their own whispers echoing back, leading them to another hidden passage. The passage led to a narrow crawl space. The friends took a deep breath and crawled through, determined to uncover the house's secrets. They emerged in an old laboratory filled with strange equipment and glowing liquids. On a table, they found a glowing vial and a note. The note contained the final riddle, I can be cracked, made, told, and played. What am I? The friends put their heads together to solve it. Dana exclaimed, a joke. As they spoke the answer, the vial glowed brightly, illuminating a hidden door in the wall. The door led to a treasure room filled with old artifacts and sparkling treasures. The friends couldn't believe their eyes. Suddenly, a friendly ghost appeared and thanked them for breaking the house's curse. The ghost explained that the treasures were now theirs to share. With their new treasures and a sense of accomplishment, the friends left the horror house, their adventure forever etched in their memories. Back home, they sat around the campfire, sharing stories and laughing about their incredible adventure. They knew they'd always be friends, no matter what spooky adventures came their way. And so, Alex, Bella, Chris, and Dana ended their adventure closer than ever and ready for whatever came next. Until the next adventure, goodbye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more exciting adventures.